Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Spain. Welcome to Albarathine. Uh, I'm here on holiday for a bit of a bouldering session. Got inspired to come here by the Epic TV video uh, that Hugo made, who works at Epic TV. That was with 27 Crags, and it's like a destination guide. And check that out, because the link is in the description below. So uh, we've been here one day. Uh, the bouldering is incredible so far, but I'll tell you more about that in a second. Behind me is where we're staying, which is the Sandstone Guest House, which is super reasonably priced, beautiful, cozy, lovely, all full of climbers, and let me show you. So it's a well-known fact that every uh, climber's guest house needs a giant chair and a slack line, but you know, Mainly the giant chair. So as you can see, super pretty outside and it's equally pretty inside. So let me show you. Morning. Morning. Ooh, breakfast is good. This is the kitchen, it's like a shared space. And then there's this beautiful room here. Where everyone sort of chills out. Nice, relaxing vibes as you can see. So yeah, an awesome, awesome place to stay. Um, so do check that out, link is in the description below. They've just been lovely to us staying here. So with my friend Liz, who I go on many adventures with climbing uh, and we're just getting some coffee and I'm gonna go and head to the crag via the supermarket for some essential chorizo supplies. So yeah, spin to the, well, the bouldering area. Welcome to La Fuente, uh, which is an area near the main car parking bit. So yesterday we went to uh, a Rastadero, uh, I climbed zigzag, second go, which is really cool, 7A, classic thing. Climbed a Jecta, I think it was, like 7A plus. Went right at the very end of the day and another 7A as well and a bunch of other stuff. Uh, the stuff you can see on screen is the 27 Crags app. Uh, it's really cool, I've been using it a lot while I'm out here because it's just super handy. So do check that out if you want. Lots of crag and topo guides. So yeah, we're here. New area for us, so we're gonna have a little look around, have a warm up, and then get on something cool. So we found this slopey 7A thing, which is really cool. Loads of people working it, it's like a horrible, horrible top out. with that skin in my teeth it's like a such a slopey top out it was horrible um yeah there's like a 7b next to this which is like similar kind of slopey top out so might give that a go maybe i'm feeling the slopey top outs today who knows we'll see Okay, so after that horror show 7B, which I couldn't really get off the ground, uh, I found a 7A plus around the corner, which is way more me, upside down, thuggy, sight on this one. Yeah. 
Yeah, second go. Apparently it actually helps if you do hit the tick marks that are very obviously there and not just miss them. Next one. All right, so we are moving on. We're trying to find a boulder called Orgasmo. Orgasmo? Orgasmo. Orgasmo. Now, I feel like this sort of boulder's right on my street. Um, I've heard it's fingery. There's some jugs. Why don't you tell them about the one you did yesterday? One I did yesterday? Ejaculator. I thought it was ejector. I did ejaculator and now I'm going to go orgasm. No. no? Orgasmo. Orgasmo. The point here is, I'm a sex god. Okay, so uh, the boulder's behind us. Uh, there's a 7A plus I want to try, but there's also a 7B that looks just amazing. So I'm going to give that a crack first. See how that goes, then do the 7A orgasmo jobby thingy thingy. Yeah, you get the worldwide job. Cool boulder. Okay, one last go. This lady top up thing before my skin falls off. One last go. So I feel like today is the day of six, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven A's or seven A pluses. And with that in mind, someone's told me there's the world's easiest seven A plus around here. And I think you know that I'm not the kind of guy to, uh, sorry, someone is screaming, it's a dangerous place. Um, I, I will, I'm accepting this easiest seven A in the world challenge. There it is. I'm not even convinced it's seven A, but I mean, check this out. Look at that, starting off terrible holds. To a good hold. To a good hold. If I don't flash this, then what buying for? Dinner. I'm buying dinner. Yeah. I bought dinner last night. <laughs> You're buying dinner again then, by Elizabeth. If I don't flash this, I'm buying dinner. I really hope you don't flash it. Okay, here we go. You ready for this? Are you ready? <laughs> it's actually quite difficult. <laughs> Does that mean you're buying dinner for the next two nights? Five, ten percent. I don't know where I'm going. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Which level? Right, the weather is coming in. It's looking all a bit grey. So I'm going to try one final 7A, 7A plus thing with apparently a top out of pure terror and doom. Cool flash to finish today. So, yeah, we're out of this area. Uh, spin to the tapas bar.
Right, so that's it for today's vlog. Thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for checking out Alba Racine, Sandstone Guest House, all that stuff. Food has arrived, we're gonna eat. See you later. Paid for by Matt. I, I had to buy it. <laughs>